must just warn you, right, that um, th- this isn't the most linear show you're likely to see tonight, right? <laughs> just warn you in advance, right? I may tend to, I might, and then, you know, you never, and way, <laughs> possibly. The, um, th- if you get a bit confused, don't. Just, uh, just think of it a little bit like an episode of 24. That's the best thing. <laughs> Previously on 24. <laughs> That's all the different things appearing on the screen and the clock. I know it sounds just like a, a little vole nibbling away at somebody's leg. What the? Ah! There's a tiny vole biting the back of my ankle. Get off it! The, you know what that show needs, I think, 24, right? It should, uh, you, you know, when they're showing you all the different stuff that's happening, they should just show you one bloke that you haven't seen all series, right? Just some random bloke, just serving ice creams. Like, uh... <laughs> the, and the camera comes tracking in like that, and it just cuts to him. Can you hear that noise? I can definitely hear a noise. It sounds like it's either a clock or a vole nibbling somebody's leg. <laughs> Look at the detail on that ice cream. Look at that. Oh, you don't get that with many shows. You know, a lot of shows, this is all you'll get. That's no good, is it? Watch again. Watch the detail. You're watching, son. Are you watching? That's me, ice cream apprentice. The, um... Watch and learn, son. Watch and learn, right? Get your ice cream. There's the cone, right? There's the machine. Catch it on the bite. Right? Just, just catch it on the bite. There we go. Right? You ready? Here. Oh, and it's off. Look at that, eh? Oh, check out the wrist motion. And finish. <laughs> the, uh... I'll tell you what I'll do. You, you seem like nice people. I'll do you a double header. Here we go. Right. Right, you're watching, son, you're watching. He's got to get his license. He's got to get his ice cream man license. The, uh, the, uh, right, here we go. Double header. Look at the suspense in here tonight. Oh my God, is he going to pull it off? I can't believe Noble would attempt something so crazy. This many people in a room all focused in on the ice cream. Don't worry, folks, I think I can do it. The, um, oh, it's like some sort of action movie, isn't it? Like the ice cream's rigged up to a bomb. And if I don't, I don't know how that would work, actually, but uh, the, um, the handle, if I don't keep dispensing ice creams, the bomb goes off. The, uh, oh, shit the bed, I'm never going to finish this. Oh, the, um, I'm a fool of myself, I should just, I should get an elastic band, jam the handle, go to lunch. That'll be fine. Get a safe distance away. That ice cream van exploded. Yeah. The, um, I'm not bothered. It's franchise. The, um, oh no, that would be a bad thing, wouldn't it? If it was part of a company, that's one thing. But if it's a franchise... Anyway, let's not dwell. Let's not dwell on exploding ice cream vans. That's, um, that's actually the, uh, the new plot of the next series of 24, you know. My name's Jack Bauer, and there's a bomb in an ice cream van. Mm. The, I don't know what that was there. Mm. The, yeah, what are you doing, Bauer? Mm. Nothing. <laughs> Jesus, I don't know. I don't know what Bauer's up to, but he went. Mm. Like that. Are you on the toilet? Oh, don't be like that, no. Terrorists have trapped me inside a cage and I've oiled myself up with goose fat. And I'm trying to slide through the bars. Ooh. Oh, that's better. Lucky I had goose fat with me. The, um... That's what he's like, Bauer. He's always on the case, you know. He, he actually carries a goose with him. Uh, all the time in a backpack. A particularly greasy goose as well. Which is uh, always a faux pas if you're out to dinner. And uh, I know you've got a dress code. Do you mind if I bring a greasy goose in? <laughs> Rather you didn't, if you don't mind. But what if terrorists capture me and uh, put me in a cage? I need to rub the greasy goose. 
probably you kill the goose and then get the fat rather than actually rubbing a goose on yourself. That's, uh, that's always a social faux pas. I don't know if you... The, anyway, what was that? Oh, yeah, that's right. I was making the double header, wasn't I? The, um, the, the suspense is, too, is genuinely too much for some of you. Go on, you fucker. Or are some of you just desperate for an ice cream, just going, could you serve us, please? <laughs> yeah, what, here we go, watching, right, watch and learn, look at me, like I've got a genuine machine there. Watch and learn. Oh, there it is, look at that, you see the action there? Yeah, it's a figure of eight for the double header, always a figure of eight. Don't attempt ice, ice, finish, don't do that, because the ice cream doesn't adhere together, and it just thump off the side. And it'll fall, and you know, if a small child, it might, it'll, if you position it right, it damages both of their shoes. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I actually gobbed on myself there. Anyway, what was I on about? Oh, yeah, the hats.